Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ramesh. In today's session, we will discuss about wait, notify and notify all methods declared in thread class or object class. So, okay, let's, this is one of the tricky and important entry question. Let's check it. In which class these three methods are declared. First of all, let's check the purpose of these three methods before we just go on check like you know where these methods are declared wait method tells the th current thread to release the lock and go to sleep until some other threads enters the same monitor and calls notify method and notify method is used it wakes up single thread that is waiting on the objects monitor and coming to the last method notify all method it wakes up all the threads that called wait method on the same object actually okay this is the difference between wait notify and notify all methods and the reason behind like you know we can conclude that like you know wait and notify you know work on the monitor level okay monitor is assigned to object not the particular thread okay actually these methods work under monitors level not the like like you know so in the thread level actually okay and hence like you know the wait and notify methods are defined in object class rather than in thread class because these methods will work under monitors level which are like in an object class hence these like you know methods are declared at you know object level not to any specific you know, thread level actually hence wait and notify methods are defined in the object class rather than the thread class if wait and notify were like an on thread instead of you know each thread actually would have to run know the status of the every other thread and there is no way to just you know know the thread one thread two was waiting for any resources to access this is the major reason of like you know behind like you know why wait notify notify all methods declared in object class rather than that class okay hence notify wait and notify all methods defined in the object class in java this is the major reason behind you know the declaring wait notify and notify all methods in object class rather than thread class actually okay and coming to what are the different methods available in like you know, thread class okay these are the common and major usually method like you know uh, in thread class let's check it like you know one by one okay if you want more details on you know real time scenarios you can check my previous videos for more information i have done like in a few videos on these all these methods okay let's check it like you know high high level actually sleep method is used thread dot sleep method is used to sleep like you know we can pass the some uh, milliseconds actually here and until uh, uh, like you know those milliseconds like you know, it will just you know sleep the thread actually easy alive method is used whether the current thread is alive or not okay and current thread is used for you know getting the uh, running thread currently running thread and if you want to get the name also we can use the get name method by using current thread dot get name interrupt method is used to stop the thread for some time actually okay and it will be interrupted okay and okay yield method is used okay just to give the priority to same priority threads and just you know the current thread will stop for some time until or unless like you know so the same priority threads will run and then the current threads will run actually you can also refer my previous videos okay about wheel method also and coming to the start method thread dot start method we can use it it will create a new thread and just you know run the run method actually okay run and run is the like you know we can provide the all the body in the inside the run method and coming to set name method we can also set the name actually by using set name method and if you want to get the name of you know the set method and we can also get the name by using this method set priority and get priority and these methods are used to set the priority of current thread and get the priority if you want you can refer my previous videos about like you know the minimum and maximum and average priority and the minimum priority is one actually and maximum priority is 10 and average priority which is default priority is five actually okay and based on the highest priority like you know the threads will take the i mean priority and start running and join method is used it will stop the current thread and just you know until the other threads finish and the current thread will not run actually okay if you use join method 
okay and set daemon method is used okay if you want to set the method i mean uh, a thread actually daemon daemon is a low priority thread which will complete like you know until or unless all threads finish right this the priority demand thread is a low priority thread if you want you can just refer my previous video about this one how to set and get and you know check the daemon thread and and is daemon method is used to check like you know whether the uh, I mean current thread is daemon or not by using this method like you know we can verify it and there are few more methods also there and these are the commonly used you know thread class methods available like you know in Java and this is all about like you know today's video this is uh, you know one of the tricky and uh, important interview question uh, please don't get confused okay so as soon as we see like you know, wait notify notify all methods declared in object class since they are working at objects monitor level okay not the thread class level okay this is the key point behind you know declaring these three methods in the you know object class instead of thread class actually okay and just practice it then all these methods then you will get like you know some fair idea okay and please like this video share with your friends and comment if you have any doubts and subscribe my channel for more interesting videos thanks for watching and have a nice day